Yeah, this is the Reparay Zone. Giving a shout out to the world. So, Mark, a disappointing result here this afternoon. What do you think your side like today? Um, I think hit the ball well enough when we had it. I think we know when you come to play all team, they're going to play a possession based game, they're going to be patient, they're going to keep the ball, they're going to try and move you around, which, which they did. Um, and we had it, we knew that if we beat their early press, we could keep the ball as well, but we were far too sloppy in possession, we kept giving them it back, which gives them more chance to put more pressure on us um, and have more ball in our half of the pitch that worked it well and uh, obviously got themselves into our penalty area and we're very fortunate to get a, a very soft penalty. Um, then after that, you know, they, 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 they kept doing what they were doing and, and really poor goal to give away the second ball. You know, for all the, you know, the play that they have and the way they move the ball, it's a ball in their channel which we should deal with and we didn't deal with it and, and they scored the second. And then we started playing and then we started actually moving the ball around and being patient and had a little spell. Half time we said obviously the next goal is going to be vital and, and really poor goal again, the third one to give away. We should have scored two goals straight afterwards with two great chances. You know, they were far more clinical than us as well. Great chances to score. Um, and then the fourth one kind of summed it up really. Uh, across it just loops the lad, he missed kicked it and still had time to put it in when we're, you know, a little bit ragged chasing the game. But it's the first time we've not scored a goal all season. Um, we still should have scored goals, but we were just just too sloppy in possession. If you keep giving all three of the ball, the way they play, they, they'll punish you. Uh, sooner or later and credit to them they, they punished us today on enough occasions from yeah. some of the several opportunities we gave them with the ball. Yeah, we made quite a slow start to the game today which is something you said did last week, obviously managed to recover. Is that something you need to think you need to it was slower, such we came here we knew that you two options, you can go press them and press their goalkeeper and, and they might pick you off or you can maybe sit back a little bit which is what we did and, and try and get them to play through you and, and I don't want to blame a referee in decision because you know four 0 I can't blame a referee decision for, for losing the game. But it's never a penalty in a million years, and goals change games. So if that doesn't go in, then 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 who knows what what happens after that? But um, you know we we felt felt reasonably comfortable. You know they had a lot of ball, but weren't really hurting us, and we had opportunities on the break that we didn't quite quite take advantage of. That you'd have felt you know the more the game had gone on, we, we may have taken one or two of those. Um, but no, they've, obviously they've got a little bit of a number on us, haven't they? They've beaten us three times now. Um, I'm glad there's no other cup competitions that we can draw them in. Um, so yeah, disappointing one. Obviously, we've not, not played well. 4-0 uh, defeat is not something that anyone wants to wants to take. But they're a good side to see the run that they're, they're on. Um, that they'll do well this season, and especially playing on this big pitch, they can move teams around. We were just not streetwise enough. When we had the opportunity to play on this big pitch, we, we didn't use it well enough. And, and you know, the fundamental part of our play is, is keeping the ball and keeping it moving. And we didn't do that well enough at all today. Give them the ball back on too many occasions. When you do that with the quality that they've got, they'll, they'll punish you. And, and today they did. Yeah, you're back in league action next week against Telford. How important is it that you produce a reaction? It's just the next game that we'll be going, going and trying to win. You know, we. Everyone's down in the dressing room. We've just got beat four 0 but we've got to remember we're top of the league. What you know, what we've, what we've, the position that we've put ourselves. We've been doing really well so far. So um, just got to get ourselves back to um, some of the basics that, that make us a good side, which is um, moving that ball quickly, moving it well, and, and getting ourselves strong and solid out, out of possession. Um, obviously, there's food for thought after a game like that, but. You can have ups, ups and downs through the course of the season. I think last last three games not played particularly well, and maybe just having a little bit of a little bit of a um, you know, lack of drop of form, I guess. But opportunity next week, great game for us to go and play. I'm sure there'll be a big crowd there, first against third. Um, let's go and, and get ourselves back on track with a good result. Yeah, and you mentioned that you're top of the league, and it must be important. Obviously, it's hard on days like this, but to keep it things in perspective, really. Yeah, we've got you know the standards that, that we've set, whether we're top of the league, middle of the league, or the bottom of it. And, and certainly today, we, we didn't meet those standards for a majority of the game last week. We didn't. Curzon, to be fair, were one of those games that could have could have gone either way, and, and we didn't play particularly well, but weren't weren't bad either. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a tough league. See how, how good the teams we are that we're up against. And Altrim are a really good side. They've proved it against us in, in three games this season. Um, 
and we've got two really tough ones coming up, Telford that are playing really well and, and, and Southport that have hit some good form as well in the next two games. So big games and games that are probably a perfect couple of games for us just to get us, you know, Curzon and Ashton, probably games that people don't look as as some of the bigger games in the league, even though obviously they are important. But you know, these next two, Telford uh, should be a good crowd in a real real challenge for us and the Southport are in good form and had a, you know, a great run in the FA Cup as well, should be a good game the week after. So um, can't get too down. Disappointed, obviously, with, with the way things have gone today, but you know we, we, we know that we've got some good players in that dressing room, and we just probably have to refocus and just just start again a little bit this week and, and get ourselves going again. And, and we'll look forward to next week's game. I'm sure we'll give a, a better account of ourselves.